A day in the life at Big Bite, guys. We got Raul busy here with a deep clean on the rims. You can see this man is getting his mind in action on a Monday. Hey, Raul, what's the process? What you love what you do. <laughs> what's the process here? So, first of all, we hit our special chemical on the rim. Yes. Well, for the rim. Magandi Muti. <laughs> <laughs> then we get into the barrel of the rim, which no other car wash does. Correct. And then we hit the face. We go into the wheel lining behind the rim. So this is a general car wash, eh? Yes, sir. That's what, that's what I'm happy about. Behind me, I can see my man Kireshin there. He's uh, tall enough to do the top there. You need a step ladder, boss? I'm good. You're good? Yes. All right, man. And deep wheel clean. We removed decals here. There's a whole lot of decals. They're going to do a hand polish. Our famous hand polish is doing the best. And you know what? It's meant for white cars even better. Eh? It, it does an awesome job. And then this car is going to come in there for an interior deep clean. One bucket. But so far, this man is one man in this car. I'm proud of him. Behind us, we have here is a hand polish again. And you can see our specialist here. Talent has been trained by myself. You can see one thing that tells a good polisher is his patterns. So you see the fish scale pattern. And then his pressure is even. His pressure is good. He knows how much pressure to apply. And remember, his motion is also a good motion. And his patterns are good. So he's removing and he's getting full coverage. We call this full coverage polish and it's not random it's thought about on that side also a polish happening here hand polish now a hand polish is only 350 bucks yeah I know are we making a profit no are we getting our name out there yes the client had a headlight that was actually uh, badly badly sun damaged so we flattened and polished that and we got it looking back to fresh man back to fresh we're gonna ceramic coat that Guys are busy with the interior. This car also came in for hand polish as well. Look at the patterns. We'll remove the polish out soon. Now I'm sure you guys want to see what's happening with our Mark 1. Yo! Oh, the amount of structural support work that we've been doing here is crazy, man. So you can see a lot of things are cut. So what's happening here? I removed the firewall here. I'm rebuilding a custom firewall. I'm redoing the flooring. I'm strengthening. And you know, I like to get things down to the bone. So all the rust, I want all the rust out. It's very really hard to get a Mark II two-door in today's time that's actually meant. I'm sure if I sandblast most Mark IIs, I'm going to find gang rust. So I'm going to make sure that that's done first. It's okay if it takes me more time, but I'll be happy because when my roll cage comes in, I want things to be solid and strong. Especially this motor mustn't twist. So custom suspension build, that's also coming in. Um, taking time, taking time. We've got the smoothie bar, which is happening that side. So Nozzy mends the smoothie bar. Hey, Madala. You got that expensive paper, eh? Yeah. How much you paid for this paper? <laughs> hey, Baba, you must sign for this paper. 500 rand. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you. That's expensive 3M paper, Baba. Yeah. You can't just use that paper. I see our 7 is ready to go. In the back, you can see there's another 7 there. But on this side here is our smoothie bar. And you must know Nozzy is doing the Hello, Noz. Yeah, Mrs. Big Bite is also doing her thing there. But that's a day in the life at Big Bite. Thank you guys for tuning in. Don't forget to share, like and comment.